Hey everyone, welcome back. Happy Friday. You made it through the first week or week zero, as we like to call it, of CS125. And I'm really proud of you. Uh, those of you that are new to this, we've gone over a lot this week. We've been kind of bringing you in piece by piece. And this is how we do things in this class. So, you know, one of the things that we've always tried to do with CS125 is make the first week like the second week, like the sixth week, like the 15th week. Um, you know, there'll be times when things will get a little heavier and there'll be other times when things will get a little bit lighter, but we really try to smooth things out over the course of the semester because we know that cramming doesn't work. Trying to do a bunch of things all at once doesn't actually lodge those things in your brain in a permanent way so that you walk away from this class with a valuable skill and valuable knowledge. So we do a little bit every day. Uh, we're gonna have some weekend homework problems this weekend for you to work on as well. We'll do that until the machine project comes out. No lessons over the weekend, just a couple of problems to, to keep you thinking, uh, to help apply some of the stuff that you've learned so far. Um, but again, this is how we do this class. You know, We come right out of the gate, we try to hit the ground running at a good clip, and this is what we're gonna do from now until December. And again, I want all of you here for this entire journey. You can do this. I know it. I've seen people who have never coded before totally transformed by this class. Um, so if you're feeling a little bit lost, if you're feeling a little bit confused, please reach out and make contact with us. Some of you haven't done any of the homework problems. I find that worrisome. Uh, we're going to start to try to reach out to you a little bit and, and, and offer some help. But please also come to us. Um, this is for everybody. This is something that everybody can do. This is something that everybody can learn. It doesn't matter if you have a math background or don't have a math background. It doesn't matter if you're particularly logical or not. Uh, you can get this step by step, piece by piece, line by line, day by day. You can do it. Um, I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. It's a little bit of a redux from yesterday, but we're going to kind of uh, ratchet up the complexity level a little bit talking about our conditional expressions and statements, and then also explain a little bit about some of the consequences of blocks of code. So I hope you enjoy. Again, welcome back. Welcome to Friday. Enjoy the lesson. You are not alone.